Hey guys, this is part one of Home Street. In this video I'll be covering how to create a character and the start of the game. So there are two sections when you start after you've named your character. You've got basics and then you've got casual. So basics is the skin colour, eye colour, face shape, body shape and gender. And then you've got the casual, which is the hair, makeup, clothes, all that sort of thing. I really do not like the hair choices you get at the beginning of this game. But hopefully we'll unlock more as we progress through the levels. Then you've got clothes. Again, there isn't many choices when you first start the game. They are, again, not great, but hopefully they will get better. But you can change the colour of the item. So you select the one you want and then down the side, next to your character, you'll see the colours and you can pick the colour you want that item to be. Once you click play now, it will say are you sure, so click yes, and then the game will begin. You'll see a house in the middle of the town, a removal van will appear with all your items in it, because you're moving in. Maya will then appear, she will guide you through sort of the game and give you a tour of the town and stuff. So tap on the boxes to unpack and they will be moved magically into your house. You can buy more items and redecorate the house as the game progresses. Then Maya will ask you to create a painting. These are jobs. So it says to complete a job, you need to start with a fault. Faults can be used at workstations to produce many things, including paintings. Collect your item when it's ready and visit the jobs menu to complete the job. So you get loads of jobs appearing in the jobs menu. It tells you what item they want you to make and then you can go and make it on the workstation. I'll show you with this one. So to make this painting, you need creativity. So click on the fault bubble. You'll see the faults that are currently being made or have been made. If you click on these, as it's showing you with the creativity, click on that and you will collect it. The ones along the top show you how many you have of that item. If it says free, that means that you have one free one to use. You do need to have a fault to be able to make another one. So if you don't have any fun say which is the face one if you don't have any fun you won't be able to make any more so now you have the fault you can click on the easel and then it says portrait and it tells you what you need for that so you need one creativity so click on the 45 second button it will take 45 seconds to make we're going to speed it up with a gem and then we can collect it the portrait will appear outside of the easel so you click on this and you've made it. Now in the corner there's a phone image and it'll have a tick on it when you complete a job. So click on this and you'll see all the jobs that you have to complete. And there'll be Maya's job on there, so you click on that to complete it. Once you complete Maya's job she will leave and then a pop-up will appear about completing jobs and you will level up, you'll reach level 2.
You unlock the baking oven cupcakes which is on the baking oven and you also earn some gems and some coins. Now we've unlocked the baking oven we're going to buy it. So if you click on the shopping cart it will open the store. This is where you can buy things for your house. So we're going to buy the baking oven. To do this we need to drag it into the house and then click on the green tick to place it. It will take some time to assemble but we're going to skip it with a gem. Once it's assembled you have the baking oven. So we're going to bake the cupcakes but firstly we need some fun faults. So again you go back to your faults and then you can click the fun ones. Then we can go back to the baking oven, click on it and click on cupcakes. This will take one fun and it will take one minute thirty. So click on that to start baking. And then it will say welcome to home street. You get some gifts for starting the game. So you get gems, coins, creativity, free knowledge and free fun. And that is it for part one. Subscribe now to check out part two when it's available. Thanks for watching. Bye.